sunny mob so today i'm not having such a good day today like i'm not happy today at all i'm kind of frustrated kind of angry i am still in the crisis it's been a long time i've been in a crisis since january 10th i've been in two crises since january 10th um in pain every freaking day and i'm just so frustrated and and angry and i don't know what else to do besides you know tell my feelings out otherwise i'm gonna lose my shit <laughs> well i am losing my shit but yeah i'm just not feeling uplifting today you know let me know if any um uh, if any of you sickle cell warriors ever like be depressed after a while after being in a crisis because i think i'm getting there i think i'm there i don't know like i'm just so frustrated i'm tired of being in pain every day i'm tired of taking meds every day as soon as I wake up, I'm in pain in the morning time. I'm tired of people. I don't know. Like, I don't want to hear any advice right now. Like, I don't want to hear anything positive right now. I don't know. I don't want to hear you can do this, you're strong, keep praying. I don't wanna hear any of that. Because I don't feel strong right now. I don't feel strong. And around these times, I, I really like to be by myself I don't know why like when I'm in a crisis I mean yeah I have my man with me and when I'm in a crisis and you know he cuddles with me and stuff like that but you know like when I go to the hospital and stuff like I want to be I want to be alone I don't like to have people around because it's just be a tough time for me you know it's not because you know I'm I don't want people around me or I don't like them or anything. I just that I be going through a tough time. And I don't know how to explain it. I don't. I don't know how to explain it to someone that's not going through what I'm going through. You know what I'm saying? Like, we have loved ones, of course, that support us and wants to help. But, you know, at the end of the day, they can't really help you at that time. And that sucks. They can't really take the pain away. They can't make you feel stronger than you than you actually are. They can't they can't do anything but just just be right there. And I don't know. I just I don't know. But I am feeling really weak today. I am not feeling like a happy camper. Like I just feel like I don't know when I feel like I'm doing something right. It always comes back to this, this moment, me being in pain, me just having to stop everything. Um, like when I'm in that, finally in my happy place, like I'm always in a happy place. I'm always good. Like I'm, I'm good. And then when this happens, it kind of brings me back, you know, because I'm like, why is this happening? I mean, I know why it's happening because I have sickle cell disease, of course, but I'm like, I drink water. I drink a lot of water, you guys. I eat good. Like, I've changed my eating habits so much. And I just, don't, I don't know. I take my medicine when I'm supposed to. You know what I'm saying? I don't do stuff that I'm not supposed to. I don't drink liquor like that. Just on occasions. I don't smoke. Like, I don't do anything. And my 
crisis still suck ass like and I still go into frequent crisis like that's crazy to me and that frustrates me so I just be thinking about that when I go into crisis it just brings me back to like excuse me it just brings me back to well you still have sickle cell so this is you're gonna have to sit down sometimes, you know? And I don't wanna sit down. I don't wanna sit down when I'm at a photo shoot or when I have a photo shoot scheduled or a date scheduled. I don't wanna sit down. I don't want to stay home. I don't wanna miss out on events, you know? I don't want to, but I have to. And that makes me angry. That makes me very angry. And frustrated. With myself. And I know it's, it's not even me. Like, it's not me. It's, you know, it's not just my genetics and stuff. Like, I know it's not me. But it just, it just makes me just, just frustrated with myself. With, with my body. Like, I just feel like my body hates me at that moment. Like, right now, I just feel like my body hates me. Like, why? Why? Why is this happening? And, you know, people think that it's just physical pain that we go through. And, and it's not the case. Like, when people treat us like crap in the hospital, like, we not only are dealing with physical pain, we're, we're dealing with mental. It's in our heads, too. Like, please let me be okay. And I don't think people get that. A lot of people don't get that. So, I just had to come make this video because, I don't know, I just want to be, I just, one, I like talking about my, <laughs> when I feel like crap, my man usually listens to me when I'm having my breakdowns, because trust me, they happen, when I have a crisis, I have a breakdown, so, this is not the first time that I broke down like, <laughs> like this, but, yes. My man's usually here, but, you know, he's at work right now. And I don't want to call him and make him, you know, because when he's at work and I call, like, he's not right if I'm not right. And I don't want to, um, you know, even though he don't mind, he probably going to see this video, though. <laughs> and be like, why didn't you call me? But, no, I just, and then I want to also, I know, like, I'm not the only one. I follow all kind of, I, I'm subscribed to all kind of, um, other sickle cell warriors on here and i just want you guys to know that you're not alone and i want to make this channel this is the reason that i made this channel i want to make it as pure and real as possible like the ups the downs you know what i'm saying like you know so that's why i made this video and it feels better when i talk about it like now that i cried it out and I talked about it like I just feel like it's like a little weight off me, you know? I mean, I'm still in pain and stuff, and that that's shitty. Very shitty. I still feel very shitty. But, you guys, I know I'm going to be okay. It's just sometimes I just, oh, I don't feel like I'm going to be okay. I know everybody has had those moments. Well, you know, like, you're good. You know, you're going to be good, and this will pass. This crisis will pass, but you're like, I want it to pass now. And that's how I'm feeling. And it's okay that I feel like that. It's okay that I feel like shit and that I cry sometimes. It's good to let it out. So that's all I wanted to share with you guys. And I love you guys so much. And stay tuned for my next video, you guys. And I will see you guys soon.